आरो प्लस विथ वन पी एम पी व्ही सेटिंग्स यू कॅन प्रेस द बटन्स इन टू वेज शॉर्ट प्रेस अँड लॉंग प्रेस शॉर्ट प्रेस टाइम इज ट्वेंटी टू थर्टी मिली सेकंड्स लॉंग प्रेस टाइम इज मिनिमम वन पॉइंट फाईव्ह सेकंड्स फॉर सम स्पेशल फीचर्स यू शुड लॉंग प्रेस द बटन्स रॉ वॉटर पंप सेटिंग हिअर इज अ स्पेशल बटन फॉर डुईंग आर डब्ल्यू पी सेटिंग्स लॉंग प्रेस द ब्लू आर डब्ल्यू पी बटन ऑन पॅनल एंटर ऑन आर डब्ल्यू पी सेटिंग्स एंटर ऑन आर डब्ल्यू पी ओव्हरलोड सेट द व्हॅल्यूज ऑफ रिक्वायर्ड ओव्हरलोड करंट इन एम्पियर अँड एंटर एंटर ऑन आर डब्ल्यू पी ड्राय रन सेट द व्हॅल्यूज ऑफ रिक्वायर्ड ड्राय रन करंट इन एम्पियर अँड एंटर हाय प्रेशर पंप सेटिंग हिअर इज अ स्पेशल बटन फॉर डुईंग एच पी पी सेटिंग्स लॉंग प्रेस द पर्पल एच पी पी बटन ऑन पॅनल एंटर ऑन एच पी पी सेटिंग्स एंटर ऑन एच पी पी ओव्हरलोड सेट द व्हॅल्यूज ऑफ रिक्वायर्ड ओव्हरलोड करंट इन एम्पियर अँड एंटर एंटर ऑन एच पी पी ड्राय रन सेट द व्हॅल्यूज ऑफ रिक्वायर्ड ड्राय रन करंट इन एम्पियर अँड एंटर एम पी व्ही सेटिंग Long press the back button of MPV backwash. Enter in MPV type. Select PMPV from the options like MMPV, AMPV, PMPV and enter. Enter in number of MPV. Enter the number of PMPV as 1 and enter. Go to the next setting of time setting and enter. Enter in service time. Enter the service time in hours. and enter go to valve 1 backwash time and enter enter the backwash time in minutes and enter go to valve 1 rinse time and enter enter the rinse time in minutes and enter go to valve 1 motor on delay time and enter enter the motor on delay time in seconds and enter go to next step exit and enter on exit You can skip the next step. Go to next step, exit and enter on exit. You can come out from the user settings and all settings by entering on exit. Now you can see the RO status is on. Advanced setting. Press the menu key. Go to the password 64. And enter. Enter in voltage setting. Enable the voltage mode. Go to next setting of over voltage set point and enter. You can set the values as per your need. Default setting is 270. The panel will trip if voltage goes over 270. Enter and go to the next setting of under voltage set point and enter. Default setting is 180, which is minimum voltage required to run the plant. The panel will trip if voltage goes under 180. Enter the value and enter in voltage span. Default setting is 1100. Enter and exit from voltage setting. Now enter in conductivity TDS setting. Enter in conductivity TDS type. Select from conductivity, disabled, TDS and enter. Go to alert set point and enter. You can set the values as per your need. Default setting is 150. Enter the value. Alert means the panel will give you alert if conductivity increases above 150 and plant will be running. Go to the next setting of trip set point and enter. Default setting is 500. Set the values and enter. Trip means the RO plant will be stopped if conductivity increases above trip set point. Exit from conductivity TDS setting. Go to the next setting of flushing valve setting and enter. Enter in slow flush. Enter the values in second and enter. Slow flush means flushing with raw water pump. Go to fast flush and enter. Set the values in seconds and enter. Fast flush means flushing with high pressure pump. Go to auto flush and enter. Auto flush is disabled as default. 
If you want automatic flushing after some time interval, then you can choose the option of enable and enter. Set auto flush time in minutes as per your need and enter. Auto flush means after every hour of continuous running of RO plant, X minutes of flushing will take place while plant is on. Press back button. We have already done all the further settings with special buttons. So go ahead and exit from all settings. All the LED indicators of RO plus panel. You can see the LED indicator here when the MPV is in filter, backwash or rinse position. You can see this indicator when RO plus panel is in auto mode. This light is off in manual mode. You can see the indicators of raw water pump, high pressure pump in working condition. You can see this indicator when low pressure switch is on. You can see this indicator when raw water tank gets empty. You can see this indicator when MPV is in backwash position. You can see this indicator when high pressure switch gets stripped. You can see this indicator when treated water tank gets full. Emergency start stop button. In case of any emergency, you can use this button to shut down the plant. You can press this button again to start the pump. Plant operation in fully auto mode. Service time is also counted by RO plus panel. This service time will be counted only when RO plant is running. Plant is running in service position. After the service time of 10 hours and after motor on delay time, PMPV will go to backwash position. After completing the backwash cycle and after motor on delay time, PMPV will go to rinse position. After completing the rinse and after motor on delay time, PMPV will go to service position. Now we can see HPP on delay, slow flush and then the plant will work again in service position. One cycle is completed. How to skip service, backwash and rinse cycle. In auto mode, if you want to do the backwash in the middle of the service time, then you can short press this separate button for MPV backwash. After motor on delay time, PMPV will go to backwash position. To skip the backwash cycle, you can short press the MPV backwash button again. After completing the backwash cycle and after motor on delay time, PMPV will go to rinse position. To skip the rinse process, you can short press the MPV backwash button. After completing the rinse and after motor on delay time, PMPV will go to service position.